Hi everyone, it's Miss Madison from Kids Clubhouse. And can anyone take a guess on what would happen if you put corn kernels in a jar and mixed it together with baking soda, white vinegar, and water? Well, today's experiment is gonna show you exactly what happens. It's called the Hop and Corn Kernel Experiment, and it's super cool. The only things you need is a jar, two and a half cups of water, baking soda, white vinegar, and a handful of popcorn kernels. So once you get those things, let's get started and see what happens. First, you're gonna measure out two and a half cups of water and you're gonna pour that into a jar similar to the one that I have. This is optional, but you can add four drops of food coloring in for a cooler effect if you would like. Next, get your baking soda and pour two tablespoons of that into the water. Once you have two tablespoons of baking soda into the jar, get a spoon and mix it around completely until all the baking soda is dissolved. Now it's time to get your popcorn kernels and dump it into the jar. Remember not to use too many popcorn kernels when you're doing this experiment to get the full effect of what actually happens. Now get your white vinegar and you're going to pour 6 tablespoons of that into the jar. As you can see, once you pour that first tablespoon in, there's a lot of fizzing and bubbling. Let's see what happens to the kernels over time as more white vinegar is added inside the jar. As you can see by the sixth tablespoon of white vinegar, the popcorn kernels started to rise up towards the top of the jar a little bit. If you wait and let some time pass, you will notice that a lot more kernels begin to hop around the jar and start moving faster. The kernels began to hop around the jar because when the baking soda and the vinegar combine, they react to form carbon dioxide. This gas forms bubbles in the water which circle around the corn kernels, making them go all around the jar. I hope you enjoyed this experiment and I'll see you next time.